Good morning. I'm Frank Johnston. I'm a technical support specialist here at Yokogawa. I'm here to talk to you this morning about uh, Ylink, our website uh, that you can use to download software and manuals for uh, a lot of the Yokogawa products. In order to get to Ylink, what you uh, need to do is open up a web browser window. We recommend Chrome or Firefox. Uh, some of the early versions of Internet Explorer will give problems, but if you, uh, if you have a later version, you'll probably be okay. Um, once you get the web browser open, you just need to go type y-link.yokogawa.com and press enter. And that will take you to the home page of Ylink. On the home page, you'll find two search windows, a document search and a software search. Let's first look at the document search, and we're going to search for a user's manual for a DX2000 recorder. Type in the DX2000 under the keyword, and, type, and click the search button. And when we get uh, the response, if you look down at the bottom, you'll see that it found 51 different documents, but many of them are in other languages other than English. So if you want to uh, reduce the number of documents you have to search through, the easiest thing to do is just come here, select language, pick English, and that will drop the number down to 11. And if we look through this list, we can see the oh, here's that the DX2000 user's manual on the second page now the above the description is a manual number in a, with blue lettering click on that and it takes you to the page where you're going to download the actual user's manual on this page we see the download button for the main user's manual edition 7 and then we see three different alteration, notice of alteration documents. These notice of alterations are small changes that have been uh, noticed that need to be made to the manual since the edition 7 was published. Uh, but uh, once they decide to publish a new edition, they will roll these, notice, these alterations into the main manual. Um, so if you click on the main manual download button, a window will pop up and you will download the manual. Once it finishes loading, you can save it uh, to your hard drive, you can print it, um, or you can just view it on your screen and you can change the viewing attributes and look at that using, uh, using Adobe Acrobat format. Okay, um, now let's go back to the home page and look at the software search. So if we go into the software search and type in GX20, which is uh, our newer recorder line, we will find a hardware configurator software here for the Smart DAC Plus, which is the GX20. Click on that link and we get a page showing the hardware configurator. Now let me, uh, let me show you a couple of things that show up on this page. Um, at the top of the page there's typical software agreement, before downloading, release notes. The, these will take you to another page that will give you additional information. And then down at the bottom of the page there's some descriptions of the software, which models it's ap applicable for and what operating systems will support this software and give you an upgrade procedure. Sometimes there'll be a link to a written upgrade procedure and occasionally the software will require a license number. If it does, at the bottom of this section you'll see a, uh, another blue link like this. It's actually a link to another page that will, will take you to uh, a window where you can get the license number that you need for the software. And at the very bottom of the page are going to be any manuals that uh, are going to help you when you're using this software. 
Another way to find software on Wildlink is to click the products button and you'll get a list of, of products uh, and you can search through this list and find the item that you're looking for. Um, in fact, we'll look back here at document library for the recorders and you can go in and select the series and I can come down here and select the DX advanced and I can select document type as manual and now we will get the same information we got before for the DX2000 and if we go to the next page we will find the DX2000 user's manual just like we found it using the search window. So if you have any questions on using Wildlink, give us a call at our support line, on our support line, and that's 800-524-7378. Otherwise, have a good time using Wildlink and downloading your documents and software. Thank you.